So after defining the working times for a resource, then it's time to define uh, the resource's capacity to work on assigned tasks. Now this is done by entering a percentage into the max units field. Now the percentage represents how much of the working time on his or her calendar can be dedicated to tasks in the project. Now by default, a resource is assumed uh, to be available 100% of the working time on its calendar. Uh, let's just take a look at our first resource here, Darren Uretsky. Now, as you can see, his calendar is linked to the standard calendar, which indicates uh, 40 working hours in a week. And his max units is 100% by default. So what does this mean? 100% means they are uh, that Darren is available to work a maximum of 40 hours a week. So if I were to enter 50% for uh, Darren, what are we saying here? It would mean that Darren is available to work a maximum of 20 hours a week out of the 40 available in their working time. I hope that math makes sense. So if you were to enter, for example, 150% for Darren, then what would that be saying? Well, if we do the math, uh, the math would say that Darren is available for a maximum of 60 hours in the week. Now, of course, it's very rare <laughs> when you enter a percentage higher than 100% for a single resource. Uh, however, if you have a consolidated resource, then max units will likely be higher. So let's say for this consolidated resource called uh, UX designers, there are three UX designers that work full time, in other words, 40 hours per week. So altogether, this consolidated resource is available to work 120 hours in a week. And somehow we have to represent that as a percentage in their max units field. So right now, this resource is linked to the standard calendar, AKA our project calendar, where working times are 40 hours per week. And max units is set to 100% by default. So as it stands, our three UX designers are available for a maximum of 40 hours in a week, but we need the percentage to represent 120 hours. So what should the percentage be? Take a few moments to think about it. Yes, it should be 300%. Because 300% of 40 hours in a week is 120 hours. So you need to go through your list of resources and set the max units to appropriately represent uh, the maximum capacity of the resource uh, to work. Now the primary purpose of defining the max units is so that in the event you assign too much work to the resource, this can be calculated by project. You'll see later on that when this happens, uh, it is called an over allocation. You have over allocated the resource. You've given it too much work. Uh, and then warnings will appear so that you can address that situation. We'll get to see that in a later video. Let's move on.